In the past year alone, researchers succeeded in detecting 201 new exoplanets. This brings the list of planets located outside our home solar system and gravitationally bound to another host star to over 4,900. As is well known, the search for extrasolar planets is always subject to a central question. Are the alien celestial bodies possibly habitable? While experts have not yet been able to record a galactic bullseye in this respect, another milestone has been reached in the case of some exoplanets, direct imaging of the distant celestial body. Which 10 objects have already been imaged directly and what we could find out about the characteristics of the corresponding bodies, we'll reveal to you now. Want to learn more about the groundbreaking discoveries and exciting spectacles in the universe on a regular basis? Then remember to subscribe to Simply Space and click on the bell to never miss one of our videos in the future. Go ahead and show us with a thumbs up that we can keep you engaged with the content of our posts. Fifty one Arednei B. About 96 light years from the Sun, in the constellation Arednus, the exoplanet 51 Arednei b makes its orbits. The discovery of the celestial body was recorded as part of a special observation campaign, during which experts focused their attention on 600 nearby, still very young stars. Just like its parent star, 51 Arednei b is only 20 million years old, which is why it is still in its infancy in cosmic terms. At the time of its identification, 51 Aridney b was the lowest mass exoplanet that could be directly imaged to date. This direct imaging, in turn, comes with some promising features, as it allows for atmospheric composition and spectral studies. Hydrogen and methane have been detected on the planet, and the effective temperature is estimated to be between 621 and 891 degrees Fahrenheit. The mass of the celestial body is again between 2 and 12 Jupiter masses. Beta Pictoris b Beta Pictoris b has a mass of about 13 Jupiter masses, whereby its radius exceeds that of Jupiter by a good 45%. Consequently, the celestial body is classified in the ranks of the so-called Super Jupiters. The celestial body orbits around the still young, disc-shaped main sequence star Beta Pictoris, which is located about 63 light years away from our blue home planet. Since Beta Pictoris b orbits its namesake host star at a distance of 9 astronomical units, it takes about 20 years before the planet has completed a full orbit. The temperature of Beta Pictoris b is reported to be a scorching hot 2,640 degrees Fahrenheit, an unexpected fact most likely due to the planet's dusty atmosphere and mass. Rox S 42b b Rox S 42BB is another fascinating exoplanet directly imaged during scientific research. The celestial body is the steady companion of the epitomous M double star Rox S 42B, which is most likely part of the cloud complex Rho Ophiuchi. This in turn refers to a so called dark cloud in the constellation of the Serpent Bearer. In astronomy, dark clouds denote large condensations of interstellar matter that absorb light from objects behind them. The exoplanet Rox S 42 BB has an estimated mass of about 9 Jupiter masses. However, whether the celestial body formed by nuclear accretion, by gravitational disk instability, or in a manner similar to binary stars is unclear at this time. The data collected so far indicates that the planet has an effective temperature of 3,141 degrees Celsius. Just like Beta Pictoris b, Rox S 42 BB is likely to be characterized by an exceedingly dusty and cloudy atmosphere. 2M1207b it was 2004 when a team from the European Southern Observatory discovered the astronomical object 2M1207b using the Very Large Telescope. In fact, the planetary mass object orbiting a brown dwarf in the constellation Centaurus was one of the first exoplanet candidates to be observed directly. Analysis of the corresponding infrared images suggested that the one object is a very hot gas planet with an estimated surface temperature of 2,300 
172 degrees Fahrenheit and 3 to 10 times the mass of Jupiter. The detailed analysis of the infrared spectrum revealed another, not less exciting characteristic. Apparently, water molecules exist in the atmosphere of the object. However, the possibility that 2M1207b is a promising candidate for the existence of life is considered to be ruled out. Formal Hut B if Formal Hut B is indeed an exoplanet, it would be the first extrasolar planet in the history of research that could be detected directly in optimal light. However, the actual background of this exciting formation in the constellation of Southern Pisces has yet to be determined. On the other hand, there is the assumption that it's not actually a larger planet, but only a dust cloud, the result of a collision of two smaller astronomical bodies. The fact that the epitomous host star, Formal Hut, which is about 25 light years away from our solar system, is possibly accompanied by a planet is justified with the signs in the surrounding dust disk. LKCA-15b Discovered in 2011 at the Keck Observatory in Hawaii, LKCA-15b is located about 450 light-years from our Earth. What is special about this astronomical body is that, according to our current knowledge, it is not a fully developed exoplanet, but an extrasolar protoplanet. Consequently, LKCA-15b is still in an early stage of its natural evolution. According to experts, the fact that planet formation is still in full swing could be proven with the help of infrared images and the characteristic emission of 17,000 490 degrees Fahrenheit hydrogen gas. Furthermore, the glow of dust particles could be detected, which fall onto the protoplanet and provide it with new mass. In terms of its nature, LKCA-15b is likely to be a Jupiter-like gas planet surrounded by dust and gas. The researchers' measurements provided the knowledge that LKCA-15b has a magnetic field 20 times stronger than that of our Earth. WD 0806-661b If we direct our research gaze to a region 63 light-years away from us in the constellation of flying fish, we find a white dwarf there. The striking thing? The stellar relic is accompanied by an extremely cold brown dwarf, which received the scientific designation WD 0806-661b. The white dwarf is the only star in this region. In fact, it's the only known representative of this class orbiting a stellar remnant. Moreover, at the time of its discovery, the celestial body had the largest recorded distance to its host star and was also the coldest directly imaged substellar structure known to experts at the time. According to the report, the accompanying brown dwarf has a temperature that has been quantified as between just 126 and 172 degrees Fahrenheit. HD 95086b About five times as massive as mighty Jupiter, exoplanet HD 95086b orbits its parent star at a distance of 56 to 61 astronomical units. The celestial body was discovered and directly imaged several years ago by the NACO Adaptive Optic System located in the Atacama Desert in northern Chile. It's possible that the exoplanet once formed significantly closer to its host star and was later pushed outward by gravitational interactions with other massive particles also orbiting the parent star. The images of the corresponding system suggest that there may be other as yet unconfirmed exoplanets orbiting there. Regarding its natural composition, the experts assume that the atmosphere of HD 95086b harbors immense amounts of dust. Gliese 504b Whether Gliese 504b is ultimately a brown dwarf or an extrasolar giant planet remains to be determined in future observational series. Direct imaging of the celestial body orbiting the sun-like star, 59 Virginis, 57 light years away from us, was made by the Subaru Telescope in Hawaii, which graces the more than 12,000 foot high summit of the extinct volcano Mauna Kea. If we were to view Gliese 504b with the naked eye, the celestial body would present itself in a brilliant magenta. Candidate 1 As the name of the celestial body Candidate 1 suggests, the object in question does not currently have the status of an exoplanet. What is certain is that the entity was imaged in February of last year in the immediate vicinity of Alpha Centauri A. If future investigations reveal that it's indeed an extrasolar planet, it would orbit its ancestral host star at a distance of about 1.1 astronomical units. 
the exoplanet's mass would in turn settle between that of Neptune and half the mass of Saturn. Although there are still many open questions to be answered regarding Candidate 1, some features of the celestial body are already known, which have been deduced from the observations made so far. These include, in particular, the already mentioned intrinsic mass of the potential exoplanet. Due to this large mass, it's considered extremely unlikely that the celestial body consists of rock. In the context of future analyses, it's to be found out whether Candidate 1 is really an exoplanet, or possibly, nevertheless, a dust cloud or another object. We're interested in your opinion. Which of the featured celestial bodies captivated you the most? Write us your thoughts, your suggestions, and your feedback to today's video below in the comments. Are you in the mood for more exciting videos on the topic of outer space? Then take a look at the other contributions on our channel, which you can access now by clicking on one of the images in the credits. Thanks for your interest, take care, and we'll see you next time.